<laughs> I know the screen goes black for like 10 seconds before it actually comes on. Hello, all my farm friends. Welcome to the Farmville 3 live stream with Scott. Hi, I'm Scott. And my friends. Hello, friends. Hello. Hi. How's it going? It's going. Good. That's good. We're missing a couple of you guys tonight. Uh, Pia's yes. in chat, I think, though, right? And Diana's oh, in chat. Oh, she's going to say hello, but she's still at work. Oh, she's at work. And I see oh. Diana's in chat as well. Um, so it's three of us tonight, guys. Yay. Woo Ask you two questions each. Paul Roberts is here. He's the last one to chime in and say hi. This week, guys, the episode is dedicated to the one and only Don McPeak. And this is now my person I'm going to call Don McPeak on my farm. And there's her husband, Rob Sly? Style? Sly? Slies? <laughs> uh, there's Don and Rob. Look, they're, they're, help they're my helpers today. Um, on the farm. <laughs> I figured, yeah, they kind of look like... Don and Rob from the seven seconds I've seen of them in real life on Facebook, but anyways, I don't know. Don and Rob, what do you think? <laughs> Does that resemble you guys? <laughs> <laughs> Rob, Don. Um, I was gonna do John Stalins. Uh, oh wait, not John Stalins. Um, um, who's the other gentleman that joins us all the time? Um, uh, Alan. Alan. <laughs> I was gonna oh, do no. Alan, <laughs> but I covered him up because Alan has. I don't think Alan has the full beard. Uh, on his little picture on YouTube, so it doesn't really work for Alan. But anyways, that works for Don and Rob. <laughs> Rob loves it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right, awesome. now I'll always think of Rob as a hippie. Yeah, Rob is a hippie. Um, I, I, I could turn those people into t-shirts, <laughs> oh, Rob and Don. When I'm coming visit you, I'll bring you a t-shirt. One, one with Rob's picture on it. Don, and... <laughs> Don says that, yes, Rob wears a daisy in his hair. <laughs> nice. I don't know, some LSD in the 60s or LDS in the 60s or whatever it is. Anyway. LDS, of course. LDS. Um, Sounds like guys, a computer program. Don sent an awesome bio. Let me start out. We're going to we're gonna read a little bit of it while the room is filling up with chatters. Um, do I have one now, Alan says. What is Alan talking about? I wasn't <laughs> sure. The picture? Oh, the picture. The Oh, does he have one now? Oh, that could be. I don't know, um, John. Anyways, Don says... Dawn is 54 years old. It wasn't me that's saying it. She's telling me to tell it. So that's how old Dawn is, which is an awesome age. Um, a little bit older than huh. me, but that's cool. She grew up in Southern California, and she moved to Oregon in her 20s. Um, and she's been in the Oregon ever since. In the Oregon. In Oregon. Oregon. <laughs> Oregon. Oregon. Is it Oregon? 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 I don't know. I say it wrong, I'm sure. I say Oregon. Um, she's married to Rob. If you don't know what Rob looks like, <laughs> right there with the flower in his hair. Um, she's married to Rob, and um, for eight years they've been together, and married for three years, which oh. is kind of awesome. Rob is also from California, and uh, they met online on a dating site and connected over their mutual love of music. <laughs> oh. So the, the hippie theme is right, Andy, just FYI, you know? I mean, is it it's says, probably... She says he wears a flower in his hair, or a gun. Hey. Or a gun. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Wait a second. No. Oh, uh, I'm not saying what? Oregon. My apologies. I'm sorry. It's my gun. I can't see she's, it. She's do. She's giving you a uh, pronunciation. Oh, yes. or or Egan. Or Egan. Or Egan. Okay, good. Um, they love living in Oregon, 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 or Egan. Uh, or Oregon. Oregon. Anyways, they love living there. It's a beautiful state. Um, they're about an hour away from the beach, mountains, or desert. We plan on building a log cabin wow. in, uh, near the river when we retire so we can go fishing every day and have a large garden and raise chickens. <laughs> oh, you guys got to retire before I visit you because I so want to go visit that place with the chickens. <laughs> that would be so good. Lots and lots of chickens. Um, Don has a grown son who is an EMT pr paramedic and two young grandsons and a stepdaughter who lives in California. Uh, Don loves cooking, music, baking, gardening, crochet, decorating, and anything where Don can be creative. She's worked for the oh. state for 22 years as a senior benefit retirement analyst and was a diehard fan of Farmville 2 and played for several years before Farmville 3 came out. Her favorite part of the game is decorating her farm and doing the Sky Race. She loves the skins that you get from the Sky Race rewards to decorate her farm. She's a little obsessed about it, she says, and sometimes she gets up in the middle of the night to check her farm, especially if she's doing a task or an event. Um, Rob and her enjoy the weekly live stream. Every Wednesday night, we get snacks out and sit side by side and watch together in our home office. 
Aww. And then she says, if it's too long, I can edit it. But it was perfect. So that was it. Thank you, Don. That was so amazing. And um, we'll break before we're going to get let just one more minute before we introduce everybody in the room. I'm going to bring up Dawn's slide this week because Dawn sent this to me. She said, hi, Scott. I logged into the game this morning and she got the VIP invite. Um, she added her name and phone number and received 100 blue gems. And she's attached a screenshot if you want to share it with the live streamers. There you go. I, don't, I can't really see. Um, nice. It's kind, of, kind of little, but yeah. So she said, got the invite. She clicked join and collected her hundred blue gems. So I don't know what else you're gonna get with that, Don. It's interesting that it's great that you're on it because now, when you do get stuff for VIP, at least you can tell us what it is about, and we can tell all of the listeners what it's about. Okay, I've done enough talking for a while, and I'll interrupt you. I'm sure, Andy, but uh, feel free. All right, I've been trying to wait for you to breathe for a second. Um, I know somebody else in chat has, has had that VIP invitation and joined it. Who else? Um, I think uh, Smoky Blizzard. Hello, Smoky Blizzard. Saw it on their farm. So I'm going to scroll up the top and let you know who's here. You do that. I'm going to get some resin. Rosie. Rosie. Kathy. Kel. C. Jean. Alan, Ragdoll, Mona. Mona, oh, we have a picture for Mona tonight. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Patty, Embella. I always pause so you can say Embella. I, I said name. it quietly. I'm trying not to interrupt you tonight. <laughs> uh, Janetta. Janetta Jewel. Uh, somebody named Pia. Pia. Catherine. Catherine. Dawn. Dawn. Tracy. Crazy. Oh, Don, speaking of which, we sent you your Google Play card about 10 minutes ago, Don. Should be in your email. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. John is here. Hey, John. Uh, John is here. John, we have a slide from John tonight. A video from John tonight. Continue on. We'll talk about that in a second. Diana is in chat. Diana. Andrew is here. Christine. Christine. Uh, Pepper. We'll probably have a few people missing because they think it's tomorrow night. And we might have some new people because they aren't available to watch us live on Wednesdays. So maybe we have some new ones tonight. Oh. Maybe. No. Did I say Kathy already? Because she wrote here. Kathy Almon? Yeah. Hey, Kathy. Well, Kathy's here. Uh, Kathy yeah, Almon. Oh, uh, while we're talking about Kathy Almon, she sent me an email this week. Uh, I did reply to it, Kathy, today, about 10 minutes ago as well, about your settings. It was blurry for you last week on YouTube. On your YouTube, you should have the three little dots or the little gear icon thingy, and you can choose a higher resolution as long as you have a good enough internet connection to do it. You click the little mm -hmm. options button and you can choose higher video quality, and that should clear it up. Unless you're on a slow connection, then it'll make it really worse, so you want to deal with it if it's that the case. But anyways, sorry, Andy. Kathy Buckingham? Buckingham! Oh, the Royal Highness. We haven't seen Kathy Buckingham <laughs> in a little while. Kathy, it's so nice to hear your name again on the live stream. I think it's like three or four. Donna's weeks. love. Donna's love. Uh, Paul. Rob. Rob. Uh, Rob Sly. Okay, I know people's last names. It's so weird that I remember these things. Pat is here. But how could I forget Don and Rob? Pat. Casings. Castings. Castings. I know it's a C. Yes. Not, I don't see the chat, so I'm just I'm just farming. So anyway. I'm just scrolling for hellos. Carol is here. Carol! Somebody was looking for Rosie, so she said hello again. I'm here. Uh, Jody. Jody! Jody White. Let's see. I think... That is all? That is... I think that is it. Uh, all right. Dawn and Rob... Me if I missed you. Are in our co-op. Whoever's in our co-op that's here tonight, and I know Andy and Libby are both in our co-op. Mm -hmm. um, I've been kind of trying to trash orders on the Sky Race, and I've been keeping. I've noticed that. All right, am I keeping the right ones? Is oh. it okay? I haven't noticed. I... Oh, you haven't been doing it. Uh... I have. I haven't been able to get all ten done. I've been six or seven of them. Yeah, I don't get all ten done either. Um, but I find that those visitor order ones are so easy now because they're so, so they come back so fast. And the exotic animal track ones, um, where you need like 15 um, quests in the track to approve, those are easy as well. Anyway, 
Uh, I like um, growing tomatoes and cotton, but I don't <laughs> see any more. Are you trashing those? I, I, was trash, I was trashing some of them. Melinda says she stops sitting by the mailbox every day. It's coming. <laughs> did you send it? And Andrew, I did receive your address for the, for the loser sticker. I just haven't designed the loser sticker yet. The loser. So I've got to still work on that. Um, anyways, um, let's move on to um, uh, John, John's John's video. Where's John's video? Oh, it's uh, it's actually a button I got to click on the other program here or the other thing. Well, don't trash the tomatoes and cotton. I'll do I'm those. On it, Dawn. Potatoes. Uh, Lib- Libby, if you see something you want, I know we're not supposed to reserve things, but if um, I'm gonna trash, I'm gonna start trashing all kinds of orders that I think aren't easy. So if you see something you really want, just reserve it and I'll save it. Okay. Okay. All right. See, I don't think we should make a rule on not reserving. It's just if you reserve something, don't be scared if someone somebody, takes it. Yeah, yeah, don't be upset yeah. if somebody takes. Yeah, it. that's that's way better. I like that, Andy. So you can reserve things, and I won't trash them. So if you do see something, guys, for our co-op, that's on the Sky Race that you really want next, just reserve it, and I won't delete it. But make sure you take it. Otherwise, yeah. Anyway, I think it yeah. comes down by. Itself. And if somebody Anyways. else takes it. Don't complain. Right. Okay. So John, last week after he confirmed um, that when you level up, guys, at least on John's farm, it finishes everything you're cooking and all your fields. And John sent me an awesome video of that happening. So John, let's play that. What? Jamie? Is Jamie here tonight? She's just subscribed yes, to the channel. Only leaders and co-leaders can trash orders. Yes. Why trash? Um, why trash, CG wants to know. Because some of them take forever to do, CG. Um, and again, if you like doing them, like say um, onions or no, uh, almonds, stuff with almonds, like half the co-op can't even make that yet. So mm-hmm. I usually trash that because not everybody can make it. Um, I like doing the boat because the boat, everybody can help out with that. Right. Boat. Yeah. And I, I do leave the boat ones. I'll leave a couple of them, like a cheaper one and a more expensive one. Cause we have like five days to do like three or four orders. It should be perfectly mm-hmm. fine. Yeah. Um, and same with the tasks on the little trucks. Those are pretty easy too. You just have to do them. Right. But yeah. there's some of them, like if you have to cook like eight items that take like eight hours to make and you need five of them, it's like, no, I just been that trashing. is the only, the really only circumstance I could see somebody reserving an order, reserve it, get a start on making all those things because right. you have a limited amount of time. Right. And once you have halfway done, now you take on the task and you're almost there anyway. So right. it, there is some use for reserving orders. That's true. And I think it'll be a good, you know, a good, a good thing for us if, if somebody's doing that, they can... Uh, Reserve it and you won't toss it out. Yeah, that's true. Okay, good rule. Um, all right, John's video. You guys ready? There's no sound to it, so it's just going to play. Don't he'll... be a tosser. All right, so you can see on John's <laughs> farm, none of his crops are ready. You can see that he's got everything growing, and all of his cookers are busy working cooking, um, and nothing is he's got, oh, so much cooking in that one that he opened up. Look at all the fries. Look at all the pizzas. He's just ready to go, guys. He's like five Holy pizzas. Lord. Oh, it was great. Um, and then John's going to level up now by clicking the little, uh, he's clicking the cow things. John, thanks so much <laughs> for sending this video. This was so good of you. Um, so great. And now he's going to click it and then boom, watch this. All of his crops instantly finished. <laughs> so good. Nice. Yeah. And then all of that Dang. pizza, all the pizza ovens are full. Like, oh, amazing. Look at that. All seven pizzas are done. All the metal. Oh, those, that's like hours and hours. That's so much yeah. money. That's so good. That is cool. That is great. John, thank you so much for sending that. What level that. was he again? 50? John, what level are you? Put it in chat. Oh, he's uh, level... F- wait, like, he had it on the screen, didn't it? Let's yeah, see. Yeah, I see it. still see it. It's 50. 50? 50? Okay. And what did Cal send me a video of? Oh, Cal! <laughs> Let's play this as well. Um, first of all, everybody who started... Everybody who sent in the task last week, uh, which was the truck in the intersection, um, these are the mm-hmm. people who... Oops, that's this week's task. These are the people who did it. Um, unless I missed you, in which case um, um, they're, you're not up there, but go ahead and start yourself with six points. Uh, the Dark Sisters are both there. They're just not together. Usually I put them together, but the other Dark Sister is um, on... Uh, oh, it's on the first row, just kind of halfway down. Uh, Ambla22, she has CPR after her name because she was busy studying for a CPR, uh, CPR um. course, which I thought was kind of interesting. And um, Tracy... What did you post, Tracy? Tracy has a post. What did I put for post? Tracy posted something. I, 
Did you get mine? Because I don't see my name up there, but I did send it to you. Oh, then just start yourself with six points. Um, yeah, I, I, it's, you it's in me. the mail. Janetta Jewel. I'm sorry, Janetta. You know, you're on there, Janetta. See, this is why you can't see each other. I told you. Right here, Janetta. Right there. Below Janetta, Patty. Below Patty. It's tough because they all kind of blend together when there's a bunch of you guys on there. Um, Tracy, what did you say? You said something to me. I, wrote, I have post beside your name. Why would I write post? That doesn't ring a bell at all. At least CPR I can remember. But Tracy, what did you post? Did you send something to, on my email, Tracy, that I was supposed to remind myself about? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I don't Short know. Short-term memory. Short-term memory. Tracy, what did you post that I'm supposed to recall? Something. You posted something. She doesn't know. I don't know, Scott. LOL. <laughs> she did something. Anyway, uh, let's get rid of this. Uh, this week, everybody, your task is and some of you don't aren't even going to know where this is on your farm it's fantastic oh. uh, you need a butterfly in the whirlwind the whirlwind oh poor butterfly do you know where the whirlwind is andy oh he's looking no. all right okay well that's the task everybody uh pixels in oh, the pixels of the I butterfly in the whirlwind uh search your farm it's around you'll see them there's a couple of them uh, Elizabeth, it's been a long time since Elizabeth joined. Is this Elizabeth Dingus? Or which Elizabeth is this? Or no, it's Elizabeth Flavin? I don't know. I don't know which Elizabeth it no, is. No, that's spelled with an S, so it's Elizabeth. Oh. Not Elizabeth. Ah, uh, okay. Like the queen. All right. Well, hello, Elizabeth. Lizzie. Elizabeth. Found mine, hey. LOL. All right. I had something I wanted to mention um, about your... The whirlwind tour you'll be doing through North America. Yeah, the whirlwind. You know, <laughs> I had a destination for you that I recommended today from that video, and I thought the video was so funny. Right. I thought you could do that video there as well. I <laughs> sure. Mean, my goodness, that was so funny. The name of the town is uh, Uranus or something? Uranus. <laughs> Uranus. Well, you can say Uranus. It's probably how it's pronounced. No, no, it's pronounced oh. Uranus. <laughs> All right. It's a planet oh in our solar gosh. system. What what state's it in again? Missouri. All right. Melinda, have you ever been to Uranus? <laughs> I heard they oh, make the man. best fudge um, in the country in Uranus. Pepper, you, you have the whirlwind on your farm. 100%. You have it. You just got to search for it. I'll bring it up again. You can see a picture of it. Look at the background um, this week. But my point, before yeah. I was interrupted... Is I think anybody who's here tonight and should should go on to our Facebook page and recommend oh. places around the country that they think Scott should visit when he's doing his tour. That's right. Not just not just oh. the country, North America, whether cool. it's in the states or Canada. Um, I know we have some wonderful Canadian watchers on with us right now, and uh, I like. Have you ever been to Niagara Falls? I've never been there. Wouldn't that be awesome? Yeah, just head up the north part. Like, so that's the plan. Mm -hmm. the, I think the plan originally for the near future will be these mini spikes into the states in different directions and different mm -hmm. angles and back. So like shorter trips. Mm -hmm. And then as the YouTube channel grows and we get more busier with it, then we'll plan like a big, long, like massive, like leave home for months at a time kind of trip. But that's the plan. But do you anyways. like the idea of oh, you yeah. know your original... Oh, yeah. Facebook or your original uh, YouTube family right here in this, giving yes. you some ideas yes. on the page. Yes, mm -hmm. give me ideas on the page. In fact, what I should probably do is make a post somewhere about that so that they're not just all over everywhere. Okay. We'll have it organized. So maybe I'll work on that. Um, I'm not sure where. Yeah, but yeah. I got to visit Farmville, North Caverns Carolina, in New Andrew. Mexico. That yeah. would be cool. yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna be so fun, guys. Um, this weekend, Ooh. why I can't stream this week? We're actually headed. Uh, we're taking about an hour and a half flight west into Kelowna, British Columbia, where it's springtime and mm -hmm. probably leaves on the trees already. It's amazing how you travel an hour <laughs> oh. on an airplane. It's about a 12-hour drive or 10-hour drive, uh, but it's like an hour Genius, hour. Andrew. Genius. Yeah, Farmville. Go visit <laughs> Sam. I'll take Sam his mug in Farmville. <laughs> oh, I got a... Uh, Kathy Almon has sent me a picture already. Good job, Kathy. In the whirlwind mm -hmm. to, to boot. Orange butterfly as well. Good job. You know where it is, Kathy. Don't worry. Everybody has the the um the whirlwind. It's on your farm somewhere. You just have to look around for them. 
they're in a specific yeah. spot anyways yeah that's the i haven't got approval yet to use the graphics so we're still waiting for that from zynga um i'm sure i'll be able to use something whether or not i can put the farmville 3 logo on or the zynga logos on i'm not sure yet we're still working things out but in either case it'll have it'll have my spaceship for sure uh, because that's my own image. That's but your stuff, yeah. That's my stuff. But as far as the background goes, I'm not sure what we're going to be putting on there yet. I'm hoping the Farmville stuff, because that's the, the point. But anyway, hey, yeah. I promised. Time. I think I made a promise last week, and i got to see if I can figure out how to do this. Well, while you're doing that... <laughs> Do you guys hear that? Oh, we don't hear that noise. We don't hear that noise. I should have. Uh, I just played the video, Exotic Animal Race video. Oh, I don't hear it. No. You don't hear it. I don't hear it either. That's why you don't hear it. But um, it'll, you'll hear it next week. Smoky Mountains. I know what it oh, go like. now. Yeah, Paul, there's all these places that I've been watching from people that walk along the uh, Appala Appalachian or Appalachian or Appalachian Trail. People say it differently on YouTube. Well, yeah, it's not called that, Andy. You're, if you go on YouTube, you'll get smacked out if you say Appalachian. It's Appalachian or something. Yeah, it's weird. I think it's um, the way to pronounce it is not Appalachian. And it has been for like 20 years on YouTube before this year. But you know what happens oh. when the liberals get in and they start saying you can't call um, things. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it wasn't the liberals. Who knows? Sure. Um, uh, Pepper wants to know how do you get the redeem option to show in settings? You don't right now, Pepper. They're still working on that as far as I, I know. Oh, good job, Mrs. Dark Phoenix, picking blue. For those of you who aren't sure what to do, pick a color, please. Green. One of these fantastic colors tonight. Tonight we're racing an animal we've never raced before, guys. Um, what? You will be able to again, Kathy. They've just temporarily discontinued it uh, for the time being, but don't worry. It's coming back. No worries. Green. Everybody's picking colors. All right. Um, we'll wait for a few more entries before we start this running. Oh, let's play the video from Cal while we're waiting. Oh, yeah. Uh, Cal sent me this video. It's hilarious, guys. Um, it's all the farmhands uh, skinning their um, privates down the... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's just let me just show it. Uh, where is it? Where's the button? Oh, it's over here. That's why. Didn't have time to enter it. Okay, watch it. Look, they're crossing the bridge. Look at Zach or Jack or whatever his name is. <laughs> they're like walking along the edge. Ouch. One leg on one side, one on the other. <laughs> there goes Polly. Oh. <laughs> Poor Scotsman, because. Uh... <laughs> oh, look at uh, Bobby Stitch. <laughs> Bobby Stitch it seemed like he enjoyed that a little too much. And then uh, Rose is going to go back the other way, doing the exact same maneuver. Hey. And then uh, here comes Doug Oates. I don't think Doug. I think Doug Oates starts, but then he veers off to the right. I think, and then the video She's ends. She's pole dancing. <laughs> so good. I'll play it again. Cal, that was the so good. The poop. Is it not? Uh, Darla go. says, "Hey, it's Tuesday. I don't think I mentioned Darla yet." Darla, First, yes. Is that your hello, Darla? Um, Darla, I'm not going to be uh, in my house for the rest of the week, so don't rob me, but I'm not going to be here um, for the rest of the week. So we're streaming Tuesday night instead of Wednesday night, this week only. Next week will be back to normal. Um, and there'll be no Farmville 2 stream this week. There might be a surprise stream from our hotel or from wherever we are on Thursday night, um, cool. just from the phone, just to say hi and uh, show you where we are. But uh, there might, that might be the only stream that we do. Um, maybe we can do a, a stream about people can be like questions that normally you guys don't ask me like stuff about me or about stuff about you I don't know we'll figure it out just got on Darla welcome Darla you haven't missed anything pick a color Darla everybody should be picking a color Rosie's taking red um, Elizabeth sounds says, like a color Rosie red gets on my nerves I always like messing with my animals should we keep our eyes closed then. <laughs> yes. If it's in the hotel. If it's in the hotel. Sure. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Live. Uh, check out Jack Tanner's hand. Uh, hands are the same width as his forearms. Jack Tanner. All right, let's check it out. He's right in front of the screen there, so we might as yeah. well zoom into Mr. Jack Tanner. Oh, you're right. Look at that. Did that change, or has it always been like that? <sighs> No, it's always it been like that. Has it been? But he's got tattoos. I've never noticed oh, he had no. tattoos. Do you never notice he's painted? It's like the painted. Moana guy. Is he? Is he from Mex or um, uh, Mo uh, <laughs> uh, uh, Hawaii? Hawaii. Hawaii. He's waving. Let's see if he's I can. He's got a big chiseled oh, jaw, though. I don't have any other skins for for Jack. 
Jack no, Melinda, Tanner. there won't be Farmville 2 this week. We're no, very sorry. Be. But it might be um, a stream, though, like a, just a stream from my phone, like a <laughs> like an actual, not a Farmville stream. Oh, Murray was very excited about that. Anyways, he's so hot, Kathy says. Well, thank you. He's <laughs> talking about me or Jack? I think I was talking about Jack. Uh, Jack. <laughs> oh, I know. I'm showing a little bit too much forehead tonight. I'm getting and we are excited. boring. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. What are we doing? What are we boring? We're boring her. She's falling asleep. Who is? Rosie. Oh, Wake Rosie. up, Rosie. Oh, <laughs> Rosie. All right, Rosie. Hey, Rosie, we named this episode after your suggestion. You know? Let's see. Yep. Bush tacos, Rosie. <laughs> that was your chat, Rosie. <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, my gosh. Uh, okay, let's go back to the races and uh, start this off. Okay, so everybody should have picked a color. Um, let's go. At this time, Libby, pick a number. Uh, let's go for three. Three. All right. Three, two, one. We have monkey, polar bear, and hog badger. We've never raced the hog badger before, guys, in hmm. green. Oh. It's the first race. Um, I had to make the um, the graphic for him. Ooh, another, Got me a hog badger. Another email. Let's um let's see where these guys are located on here. Well, I'm going to make it the cave, too. I always like to change the, the racer one to a cave. And then I think I changed. I have a cave one. Whoops. Somewhere else. All right. Um, I've cleared off more animals off my farm again. So there is even less resistance probably coming through the cornhole. Um, on my test races, one of these guys cheated on this first round. So hopefully Ooh. that doesn't happen to you guys because you won't oh. get any points if that happens. It only happened once out of the three tests I did. And um, out of the other tests, they came in different places. So hopefully we don't have one person dominating, like, uh, or one animal dominating, like, over and over again. Ooh, first I must pick my my gold. All right. Good luck, everyone. What is, who saw what? Rosie saw something yesterday. Oh, freakish hands. Yeah. Janetta. Such huge hands. I wonder if, if Farmville will ever get to the point of actually making a patch in the game to actually help our live stream like you know how i said it's difficult for me to sometimes the animals like to teleport across the screen or you know one always takes off before the other ones do i wonder if that's something that a programmer could actually fix or change hmm. in the game and i wonder if they would actually do that if we became popular enough <laughs> for this to be because it makes it a little more fair when all the animals... I wouldn't sit next to the mailbox <laughs> counting on that. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I know. I know. They don't They don't make anything off of us. Well, they probably make a little bit off of us when, when we like to promote their um, gem packages and stuff or buying the county, uh, the country event mm -hmm. or whatever. But All right, guys. Uh, starting bell, timer, and I got to get into uh, photo mode fast as I can. Too. Here we go. Dropping it. Photo mode. Yeah, oh, where is it? it. Photo mode! Oh dear, it's taking longer than I should have. Okay, ooh, they're probably Sorry. running already. Ah, uh, oh, Hog Badger's sitting there last. We have Monkey out uh. in front. Um, we have Monkey going through Cornhole Alley, getting stuck on the goat in Cornhole Alley. Mm. Oh, the squirrel's coming yes. up to fight as well. Polar Bear making up the back. Oh, Hog Badger just Come passing on, Polar Badger. Bear, guys. Let's go, let's go. Ooh, look at that. Let's Zoom go. In Come on, Badger. Monkey is out. Monkey's making his way through the sea town into the Shoot crack that house. Oh, he's fast, guys. Monkey is fast tonight. Monkey Ooh. over the wall and Monkey oh. in first monkey. place. Um, we have, Blue is the winner. We have some problems in the cornhole with the... Where's the Hog Badger? <laughs> is the Hog Badger out? Oh, Carlos uh, is like, what is uh, happening right now? Oh, no, the Hog Badger is right behind Carlos. <laughs> this is, yeah. All right, guys, we just have to send X-Locks through. It's probably going to screw up all of the... Uh, all of these animals are going to probably pop oh. out of there. We're, we'll see what happens when I when I move X-Locks through. Nice day, isn't it? All right, did that just Whoa. screw things up? All right, no, they're still stuck, guys. All right, let's move this up. Nice day, isn't it? Who said that? Oh, one of the guys? Carlos. Carlos. All right. I think they're going to all pop up. Yeah. Right. Ah, see, they all jumped out. Already. I knew they were going to. Polar Bear. <laughs> polar Bear is, looks like it's Polar Bear, unless Hog Badger's made it already. No, Polar. Oh, Polar Bear getting slowed down. Oh, Polar Bear not sure what's happening. Hog Badger coming Go up. Badger. Whoa! Oh. Who was it? Oh, Who was it? Polar Bear. You sure? Polar Bear. Yeah. Uh, all right. I don't know. That photo fish finish looks pretty quick. Monkey, polar bear, hog badger? Yep. Guess right. which one I picked. <laughs> the hog badger? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. 
<laughs> so good. Six plus nine. Um, Diana, I mean, um, sorry, not Diana. Libby, your or town. Ad, can one of you guys write down the order of those three came in? <laughs> I don't, you have a pen handy, Libby? Ooh, I the, sure do. The horse Let's is practicing, guys. The horse just practiced. Did you see that? Nice. So, monkey. Monkey, um, then <laughs> polar bear, and then hog badger. Hog Hog badger. Oh, that horse is just very feisty. Uh oh, horse. What are you doing? Oh dear, horse. Settle down, horse. <laughs> He's in heat. Yeah, She's in heat. The horse is in something. All right. It's apparently trying to dig through the. Uh... <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, let's go ahead and guys choose your. Once you post your scores, choose your second animal. Whatever you chose this time, you have to choose something else. So if you chose, or the oh. first time. All right. Oh, they're just fighting, the guys. The horse is stuck. <laughs> they're fighting. Polar bear and horse. Look, they're just battling it out. They're like. Sorry, Mrs. Dark Phoenix, but I just jinxed red. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, I chose Ooh, red. Oh, lots too. of reds out there, lots too. Of reds. Oh. oh. <laughs> the horse is having serious problems. <laughs> oh, the polar bear is doing something to Did the horse. That? That it's making us be. approve somebody who wrote monkey. <laughs> really? Yeah. Monkey? Monkey? Yeah. Well, did you approve it? Who put yeah, monkey? of course. Good job. Monkey Blue, was that Darla? No, oh. Tracy just oh. wrote monkey in it. it I had to approve <laughs> it. All right. Well, she posted, she says blue as well, so that's good. All right, you wrote down this um, placing, right, Libby? Uh-huh, I sure right. did. Last time I removed <laughs> it fast, and then we had problems. We were like, what? who was in first again? All right, it was me. That's right, okay, now Tracy. It's, it's okay. No, Nothing well. to be sorry about. <laughs> Nothing Tracy. to be sorry about. Sorry. All right, um, everybody should be choosing a new animal if they haven't already. Ooh, look at the horse is just really having some. Oh, there Gosh. he is. The horse is out of here. He's gone. Oh, I'm going to feed my chickens. I, I need some brown eggs. My mandarin duck. Ooh. The horse is just not having it. The horse is like, you know what, guys? I'm going to go back there and beat up on those animals. That's what the horse is thinking. He's going to kick it. He's going to kick it. All right. Hopefully everybody's picked. Oh, I don't have our... Squish. Uh, squish, squish. Oops. <clears throat> Jumping jelly beans. Mm -hmm. Nightbot. i got to load Nightbot so that you guys can give me your name. We can get a keyword tonight in a second, in a while. All right. There we are. That should be what we need. Darla was farming and binging, binging, binging on Laud, oh, Seinfeld episodes on Laud. Um, she was binging, Lots yeah. of Seinfeld episodes. Seinfeld's one of those shows you can kind of watch over and over again and it's still good. It's nice. The naughty horse, love it, Cal says. Oh, look at the monkey. The monkey is very, ex the monkey reminds me of Jumanji, the monkey from Jumanji's. Oh gosh, that was scary. Is and then it? The, the kid, the kid scary. was turning into. Well, the monkey part was yes, and the then the kid was turning into a monkey, and then he's like, he whispered something to him, and he's like, "Okay, I'll help you," and then whips out a tail. Like, where'd that come from? Of course, needs brain surgery. All right, everybody. Hopefully, you've all picked your animals. We're gonna zoom out a little bit. We're gonna zoom out a lot. That way, you guys can see who starts here. Mm -hmm. bloop, bloop. All right, you guys ready? Mm -hmm. We gotta switch to the uh, starting bell, 60 second timer. I don't know if the starting bell went off. And photo mode, quickly. Photo mode, boom, at least it's fast. Here we go, guys. Oh, definitely polar Whoa. bear in first place. Hog definitely. badger and monkey coming in behind, but the polar bear definitely has a nice start. Oh, does a nice maneuver right next to Rosa, passing the pheasant. Oh, having some problem. Hog badger with his nose up. Oh, hog badger pushing his way through, guys. Hog oh, badger great. and monkey. Oh, monkey oh, doing something course. to hog badger. Come on, monkey. Oh, monkey. Oh, monkey oh, monkey hog badger in first. Stuff. Monkey. Oh, it's going to be close. Oh, monkey, hog badger, polar bear. Oh, Guess man. Guess who I pick? Monkey, hog badger, Red. polar bear. Red. <laughs> Um, but Monkey was having some problems getting started, guys. That could be a problem for Monkey. Polar Bear. Um, got ourselves a monkey. Got ourselves a monkey. Take us out of photo mode. That was good stuff. We have oh. Darla with uh, 11 points. Good job, Darla. Kathy Almond. Who was the first place? Was Monkey first the first round, too? No, uh, Monkey, yes, Monkey was first. Yeah. All right, so we have a possible perfect score of um, with Kathy Almond and Darla. Uh, Rosie's also got a perfect score at this point. Andrew with a perfect score. Crystal, 
perfect score. Alan, oh, one under. That's okay, Alan. Lots of time to make up the the point, guys. Good job posting your scores. What's your um, perfect score? 11? Uh, currently is 11, right. 6 plus 2 plus 3. And um, was it Andy or Libby that was taking care of that player that we were talking about at one point? Yeah, don't worry about that. All right, okay. No problem. Okay. Okay, dokie. John Stallins with 10. Whoop, whoop for Tracy. C. Jean with 10 points. Um, once you've done your point calculations, guys, go ahead and choose your monkey. next animal. That's the white monkey. White monkey. I was also thinking about possibly in the future, for future animal races, every leg could be a different set of animals, and then you could choose any animal you like. Um, that's another possibility if we keep getting, um, like if, for example, if, who, went, who ran out front in the front the first round? Polar bear got out front, but monkey was out front the first round. But so if the for same animal leaves like way before all the other animals all the time, then I think what we'll do is switch the animals each leg. Uh, uh, why do we do we have to take a different? No, this time you can choose any animal you like, Darla. Pick any animal you like, uh, Patty. Because uh, monkey came in first place both times, you can't have twelve because you could only choose monkey. Um, if you had monkey on round one, you couldn't have monkey on round two. So you can only have 11 oh. points, uh, Patty. But but you're right. If two ad different animals were different for first and second, then 12 would be perfect, if that makes sense, Patty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good idea, says Janetta. We'll see what happens. So far, it's been pretty random, and the animals do have <laughs> chances of getting stuck on other animals and things. And so it still t kind of randomizes it a bit, but you never know. Maybe we'll... Maybe Zynga will watch our races and realize that they need to adjust things to make our races work better. <laughs> but like Andy said, don't hold your yeah. breath. <laughs> that would be that would be that would be cool. Let's pick my uh, clay. It looks like Buddy's gonna roll in that pile of doo doo. Oh, Buddy, don't do it. Where's Buddy? He was right next to the polar bear. Polar bear. Oh, he's right next to the polar it's bear. It's like pile. Like there was so many. Yeah, he was. Uh, there's like so many piles of like dirt and mud. <laughs> there <laughs> animals, is right? so many. So the dogs like to roll in it? That's right. It smells real good. Mm hmm Real good. There was a big old pile of dog on our driveway at the shop, and it looked like a human pile. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> nobody, oh, wa gosh. nobody wanted to touch it. I got to add some <laughs> holes in my in my cornhole alley. There's a few missing. There. There's still one missing, but that's okay. I'll pick the... I've been making so much stuff with withering crops since they're so cheap for me. Uh, I've just been picking them like crazy, making paint and all kinds of... Um, I've never made this many tailor items in my life. I have so many different tailor items because they're it's so cheap for me. Like those... I feel oh. sorry for the people that don't have... Like apple tree, 200. Strawberry, 150. Blueberry, 250. Yeah. Like I'm um, so cheap. I don't know what the almond tree is yet, but... Dang. Yeah, My, every... Uh, apple tree is like four, $500, I think. Yeah, me and Diana got lucky on that one. All right, I'm going to erase. Get lucky. <laughs> Get lucky. Yours didn't go down, Andy, after your reboot or your check? No. Uh, I managed to get another clothesline out of uh, one of the prize boxes this week as well, so I stuck it out. I stuck it out. Those things have been drying for a while. They no have been drying. It would be cool if you could change them. That would be Farmville 4, I have a feeling. What's so the difference? You can, you can change things on the clothesline. All right, you guys ready? Yeah. Did everybody pick a new color? I mean, a new animal. You can pick any animal you like, everybody. If you like that yep. monkey, pick the monkey. We're going to give it another 30 seconds because I don't think I actually said last call. Just Ice don't cream. shock the monkey. Don't shock the monkey? Leave that okay. to Peter Gabriel. Okay. Hey, hang me where the monkey is. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> <laughs> All Remember right. Remember the Peter Gabriel song, Shock the Monkey? Uh, Vaguely. All right, good luck, everybody. Here we go. I'm going to starting bell and then get back to starting bell, 60-second timer, and photo mode. Oh, I clicked. I missed it. Ooh, photo mode. Go. Polar bear out in front, everybody. Monkey is not sure what's happening. They're all going to take the north road because that's what they all like to do. Polar bear is a little confused on uh, Ginny. Oh, look at that. Polar bear still managing to maintain. No, hog badger. Ooh, not sure what's actually happening here. But, oh, polar bear trying to stop everybody, but... Oh, a monkey and polar bear are just going in circles. <laughs> monkey out in front, making a run for it. Monkey, you are a Dang. good racer, monkey. Oh, oh just fire. runs Whoa. over Carlos and whoever that was. Through the clothesline. Monkey in first. 
Good job, monkey. All right, where's the here comes Hog Badger? Hog Badger for a fast second. Was this the same order last time? <laughs> monkey, yes. Yes. monkey, Hog Badger, Polar Bear. Whoops, Polar Bear. Same exact. Here comes Polar Bear. Polar Bear made it out front both times the last two races. Uh, Kathy Almond with 14 points. I don't know, guys. That monkey. Monkey is pretty sweet right now. It's so thin, I think it gets by things. The hog badger likes to get by things, too. True. Rosie with a perfect score. Andrew with a perfect score. Good job, guys. Andrew decided to go for the perfect scores this time instead of the worst score possible, like last week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's good. Pull his tail. All right. Let's, let's spin the habitat, see if that makes a difference. Oops. I haven't seen Diana score yet. Diana, are you still with us? Diana, are you with us? Crystal with 13 points. Oh, C. Jean's taking the monkey right off the bat. She's like, you know what, guys? Forget this. Yeah. Monkey's winning every time. We're taking the monkey. <laughs> I am going to take the polar bear again, and I will have a perfectly terrible score. I'll lose your score. There you go. There you go. <laughs> I'm sure we're going to see a lot of blue. Spunky Monkey Janetti. Janetti. Janetta Jewel Sex. <laughs> Spunky Janetti. She said Spunky Monkey on chat. I was just reading. And you it. took it as a tongue twister? <laughs> I took it as a tongue twister to say her name wrong multiple times. I love all the people's little icons. Oh, Mona. Let's go talk about Mona for a second, guys. Uh, here's a picture I sent. Uh, <laughs> oh, I still have another slide up. <laughs> we have the video for Cal. That's funny. Um, Mona sent me this picture. This is the shirt that I sent Mona. Uh, there's no escape from Farmville Country Escape. <laughs> I, I have Calvin in a little jail That's cell. hilarious. Uh, so that's the shirt I sent Mona. I thought I sent you a different shirt for Farmville 3, Mona. And, um, yeah, that's the that's the picture Mona sent. Hey, I have that shirt. Yeah, I think you have. I have that shirt, too. <laughs> we have to send Libby a shirt. She's got nothing. I think Andy, yep. Di Diana's got a hat. She's shirtless? <laughs> She's shirtless. I am shirtless. This is my challenge. Oops. You guys just heard the 60-second timer bell again. Uh -oh. oh, well. Sorry. All right. Everybody's picking a new color. Let's see if anybody's not taking the monkey. Uh, oh, Dawn uh -huh. is taking the polar bear. She's got a good she's got a good uh, feeling about that, Dawn. I'm going to You got the scores written down, right, Libby? Who came in for a second? Uh -huh. No, one is asking... Uh -huh. If yeah, there's perfect a, score would be there's no shirt for Farmville 3. Oh, okay. Uh, there there was a Farmville 3 shirt that I did send out, and I thought for some reason that I Mona had won a Farmville 3 shirt. But if she didn't get one, then that was the Farmville 2 shirt that she got from somewhere, wherever I sent it to her. But I definitely made that shirt, so that came from me. But, uh, oh, Melinda wants a shirt. <laughs> All right, maybe we yeah. can give, give them away again once we're famous and... I mean, yeah, I need stuff. a Farmville shirt with the course on it. Farm Hub. <laughs> Libby trying out for Farm Hub. There we are. Oh, All right. Shirt. Everybody should have picked. Oh, not me. Okay, Mona. I wasn't sure. Mona, did you win something on the um, the Farmville 3, um, an uh, not anniversary, but the launch party things that we did? Did you win like a sticker or something else? Anyway. Kristen Ann wants one. Oh, yeah, somebody won the shirt. <laughs> somebody won the shirt. Yeah, we get. I ha I did make Farmville three shirts. I'm gonna go back and look. <laughs> it oh, the mug. Matter. Oh, a mug. There we yeah. are. A bunch of mugs. A and bunch decals. of mugs. Tons All right, and I'm going to race these guys back, guys. Good luck to everyone. Um, we'll see if Monkey yeah. manages to to burst out in front again, like the usual. Maybe Monkey will cheat. He's already got a trifecta. He's going for the quad. All right, here we go. On your marks, get set. Go. Photo mode. Not too bad. Where? Oh, oh, where? Nobody's. Oh, polar bear out in front like usual, everyone. Oh, Monkey yeah. jumping over and polar bear making his way through. Uh, hot jug alley. Come this on, time, polar bear. Polar bear getting stuck on the pig in the, the chop jug. Oh. But eat the pig. Monkey Quick. is so powerful. Just pushes everything out of its way. Polar Bear still managing the first place. Monkey up the Polar Bear's behind. Monkey is oh, coming oh, through. Oh. There's a couple of chickens uh, that Monkey is getting distracted the honey by. Go? But Monkey definitely... Polar Bear got confused. Over the Jump Monkey, over those. Monkey stuck on x lax but now we have a problem in the cornhole. And I have a feeling oh. everybody's going to meet in the cornhole. And we're going to have oh, kangaroo. problems. Kangaroo Here comes oh, honey, uh, Hog Badger. He's going to go under everybody. Definitely <laughs> trying to sneak in there. Good. 
Dig it. Um, we're Dig not gonna we're not gonna activate X Lax because everybody's gonna get flipped up and it's just gonna declare a winner. So we're just gonna wait yeah. and see what happens, everybody. Oh gosh. We're gonna Where's have polar bear? a polar bear's coming. There he comes. Polar bear. He's so oh, slow. Geez. Okay, polar bear. White polar bear. Oh, he's really confused, guys. Polar bear is he's trying, but we're not sure what's actually gonna gonna happen with polar bear. <laughs> he's trying. Well, Zach is trying to do some pushing. Monkey is just feverishly pushing. I think monkey's gonna burst out, guys. Monkey is. Dang. Powerful monkey has the power when he races again, guys. Pick the monkey because there he goes. Monkey Holy out Lord, in front, monkey hopping along. Gonna visit the little fox oh. for a while. Oh, got a little stock. He's taking the long way around butt wash station. Oh, but clearly, monkey in first place. Dang. Good job, monkey. monkey in first. All right, who's next? Hog monkey badger and polar bear night. at the same time. Polar bear, oh, getting stuck. Oh. Hog badger oh. trying to sneak oh. by. Polar bear still uh, managing to go through the uh, butt wash fountain. Polar bear, guys. Polar bear second. Polar bear. And well, at least I wasn't the last again. Hog badger is third. Well, that was different order at least. Dang. Getting too hot monkey, for polar monkey. bear. Polar bear starts off really good, and he's such a big animal that he gets stuck everywhere. So we're looking for. Wow, we got a lot of seventeen. A lot of seventeens. I'm um, sure we will. Because seventeen is the max. And now we're gonna spin the wheel for some points. Um, we'll need a code word in a second here. Let me get to the right screen, and one of you guys. We have can... Kathy, Darla, Andrew. Each have seventeen. Good job, guys. Rosie with seventeen. Fantastic. All right. Uh, I'm gonna put mods on as well. We need a keyword. All right. Patty has seventeen. We need a keyword, Libby. What should we choose tonight? 17. 17? All right. Uh, Everybody, well, no, seven, yeah, sure. Everybody type in 17. One seven. Sorry, Libby. I Everybody took the number? Me. If you type 17, yeah, type 17 like the number. One seven. That's what Andy suggested. Perfect. <laughs> now people are going to be so confused on how many points they have. But <laughs> yeah. this is just to get you in. Andy, don't do this again. <laughs> I should have said no. <laughs> but I just did. It was, what a terrible what idea. What a terrible idea this is. Um, 17 will get your name on the wheel, everybody. She's only 17. Who sings that one? I forget the name of the group. Right. They were terrible. Carol M, 17 from Carol M. Rosie, <laughs> Rosie types bush taco again. It's her new favorite word. <laughs> oh, that's what we should have. <laughs> oh, that. yeah, that's what we should have done. That's okay. That's what she was suggesting. Rob with the 17. Anyone else? Janetta? Janetta Jewel. All right. Copy. Take your name over here. Paste it. And I have to go to the right screen now. We got to go back to the main menu. The main screen. Ooh, there we are. And where's my wheel? Oops, that's my spacey shippy. Oh, that's my text. John was the last person to type in 17. John was? Let's see if he's on the list. Oh, yeah. I'll, I'll alphabeticalize it because then it's easier for everybody. Sort. I right. see him. He's on there? Yep. Right beside Kathy Buckingham. In between Janetta Jewel and Kathy Buckingham. The Royal Kathy, the high your the Royal Highness, Kathy Buckingham. Alright, everyone. You have literally thirty seconds to make sure your name is on the wheel. So it's all alphabetically. We just passed Carol and Darla and Dawn. Elizabeth. Embala. Janetta. John. Looks like everybody's only on there once this time, which is fabulous. Fantastic. Andy Winger sang that song, Dawn says. Winger. Winger, are you sure? Winger. Hold on, get it a photo mode while we're waiting. I just, I just the nut. I just the nut. That sounds like when I was little and we used to play what? we used to play the sandbox game where I said I won the sandbox and you say I two the sandbox. Have you ever played that game with your kids, Libby? I've never heard of that. Okay, so I'm gonna start off, I'll say I won the sandbox, and then you say I two the sandbox, and then I can keep going and then you keep going. Are you ready? I won the sandbox. I two the sandbox? I three the sandbox. I four the sandbox? I five the sandbox. I six the sandbox? I seven the sandbox. Don't say it. I... Oh, say it! Oh. Come on, you guys say it! <laughs> okay. uh, you ain't the sandbox? Oh, no! Oh. Have you heard that, I had Andy? to wreck it. <laughs> Did you hear that before? Or is that just, you know, yeah. you know where it was going? I've... Oh, okay, yeah. uh, Libby's never heard never it before. Heard <laughs> now right. I have. Good luck, everyone. We're spinning the we... wheel for two points. 
This is close, because if one of the names who has 17, they're going to get a commanding lead, and if there's a 16, Kirsten Ann, what was she at? Did anybody write her name down? Kirsten Ann, you have an extra two points. I'm wondering what she put. I mean, obviously she put 17, but who knows what she put before that. Um, are you going to write that name down for me, Libby? Kristen Ann. Kristen Ann. Kristen Ann. Two. Yes. Yay, she says. What's your points, Kristen Ann? What do you got now? Two plus whatever you had before. Come on, put you put it in, and then I'll spin it again. I'll just spin it again now. Hers is 16. So now it's... Andrew, maybe? Ooh, Andrew! Whoa! Andrew, I know, had a wicked score. I think he had a... I don't know what he chose for the last one. Oh, Kristen Ann, you pulled into the lead temporarily, but I think Andrew is now passing you. Uh, did Andrew pick the monkey on that last round? I think he did. Hmm. Time will tell. Andrew? Let's go, Andrew. What's your score, mister? And while that's happening, let's load the next list of names up. Oh, he had 17. He had 17? So he's got 19. Oh, Andrew's in the front with 19 points. Okay, two questions tonight for everybody. We're just going to ask two tonight because I am going a little short for time tonight. So we're just going to do two questions for the one point each. And we're gonna start with uh, start with Libby tonight. Ready, Libby? Sure. All right, let's do it. Libby, the question for you, do you own Vicks VapoRub in your house? <laughs> um, have you ever seen the movie called Four Rooms, Andy or Libby? No. Four Rooms. Four Rooms. It's a comedy-ish kind of a movie. Um, it has a few big names, I think. It's got some good nudity in it. <laughs> anyway, it's, um, it's, um, it's, it's, a, there's, it's a story about four hotel rooms where the bellboy has to deal with stuff. It's quite a funny uh, movie. So we're asking, oh, so a lot, of, a lot of yeses. Everybody's taking yes, except for Pat right now. And there's the, a, the Maverick. There's a Vicks Vapor Rub scene in there where he puts v Vicks underneath the kid's eyes. So if they open their eyes when they're trying to sleep. It burns them, and so it's a way of getting your kids to keep their eyes closed when they're. Oh my god, to sleep. that's awful! Oh, well, it sounds they're awful. Yeah, it, it like, sounds awful, but it's a comedy. So, anyways. Oh okay. <laughs> oh, so then it's okay. <laughs> then it's okay. Yeah, oh, it's, totally it's, it's totally a really right. funny it's movie. Um, it's quite hilarious. Yeah. Um, Jeanette is also chosen. Jeanette is also chosen. No. There's a lot of yeses for Vix in Libby's house. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. My wife, when she was younger, my mother-in-law used to put Vicks down her throat. <laughs> yeah, like stick it. Uh, 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 make me barf. Ugh. It's drinky time. Oh, you're gagging Daddy. me. <laughs> I'm gagging you. I like your orange shirt today, Libby. It matches mine. Ah, thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, I, I think. Known what color cord today? <laughs> I would have. Uh, oh, oh, Andy, seriously. All right. It has pockets. The shirt has pockets. Hmm. Pockets, nice. I know. Mine has a pocket. <laughs> I have no pockets. <laughs> no you got pockets. The, 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 the dad pocket. <laughs> the dad pocket. I have what? a spaceship. All right, Libby. Do you own in your house currently Vicks Vapo Rub? Oh, she's got it handy. Draw. Look at that! She has it handy. <laughs> it's right there. <laughs> oh, that's Wait, a Wait a second. <laughs> Put that back there. That's not Vix. Is it not Vix? Is it a brand? It's not Vix though. Rexall. That's not Vix. Does it say Vix on it? That's not. Okay, Vicks. It's, a, it's a chest rub. It's for. It's the same as what Vix does, but it's not yeah. Vix. It's a similar product, but that's like calling Pepsi Coke. That's true. So Libby, do you have Vix vapor rub in your house? Then yes, it's oh God, yeah, <laughs> somewhere. Somewhere? Somewhere. Yeah, okay. it's, you it's still have, have you still have Vix. Oh. All right. The answer is still yes, everybody. If you yes. se selected yes, you now have an extra point. Rosie moving But this into. is what I'm using tonight. <laughs> do you use Vix a lot, Libby? I do, yes. If if the boys are coughing, then yes. You put it on their chest? I put it on their feet, their chest, and then when they're closed, their eyes are all closed and they're sleeping, I put it right to their nose. Oh. Burn, burn, burn. I know. <laughs> and a little bit under their eyes. All hey, right. Gamer Tank. God, yeah. Gamer the, uh, Tank! Gamer Tank! Hilarious. Last time you came to the live stream Gamer Tank, everything went sideways. Well, it went in a good way. But welcome, Gamer Tank. I haven't been paying attention, but so far I've seen uh, Mrs. Dark Fairy with 
Oh, 17. Andrew so, with 20 points. Good job, push. Andrew. Andrew, you're smoking it yeah. tonight. All right. Next question. B would be for Andy. Ready, Andy? Yeah. Andy, do you have a honey dipper in your house? <laughs> do you know what a honey dipper is, Andy? I do know what a honey dipper is. Because uh, if you didn't, we'd go back to Farmville 2, because I'm pretty sure there's a honey dipper on Farmville 2. Anyway. Ah. Well, there you go. Does Andy own a honey dipper, everybody? That's the question of the 10 minutes. <laughs> the question of the hour. Mm-hmm. No for Darla. Let me see. What was I going to check? I'm just going to go back over here. Yeah, we're definitely down viewers tonight, guys. We're, we're about 10 less than normal. So there's people that are oh. going to be here tomorrow. Andy will have to do damage control when everybody's freaking out tomorrow night wondering where the live stream is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. That's okay. All right, a no from Rob. He's like, no honey dipper for Andy. I don't think we have a honey dipper. I'm pretty sure we don't. I've never seen one in our house, but lots of times we have stuff that I have no idea we own. <laughs> <laughs> Andy, do you have that same thing? Yeah. Like, yeah? Yeah, it's craziness. Mm -hmm. Does your wife buy stuff that and then put it aside, like clothes with clothing wise, and then when she wears it for the first time, you say, Is that new? And she's like, No, I've had it for weeks, but it's the first time she's worn it. <laughs> but it makes it sound like it's not new. My wife does that to me all the time. At least she says she does, but I could be wrong. <laughs> It's the small ways that we torture the husbands. Right. My wife came like, home why the other. Why did you pay attention? Susan came home the other night and she, she had just come back for a haircut, and I said, I, I don't see what they did. And she goes, they took four inches off, and I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> anyway, that's a big difference. It is a big difference, <laughs> but I didn't notice. I, I guess I don't pay much attention from the rear side. <laughs> I don't know. It looked the same from the front. Oh gosh. <laughs> anyway. Um, I used to have one, but I just use the squeeze bottle now, Darla says. Yeah. we. My wife rented a honey uh, last night. She was making um, something. Honey mustard, maybe? I don't even know. Is there honey in honey mustard, or is it just the name honey mustard? No, Probably. there's honey in honey. Yeah. She ran out of honey. Um, she's supposed to need half a cup, and she ended up with, like, a tablespoon. Um, we will tie, if anything, Kathy. Ooh. If anything, we will. Andrew's like, I know the math. I'm, I'm figuring it out. All right, <laughs> <laughs> here we go. Good enough. Everybody's answered. Not me. I got, I got it right. Tom, Tracy. Is Tom here? Who's Tom? Wait, wait. Kathy is it Kathy. He's, she's, he's in a tie with her. What? I have no idea. Yeah, Kristen Ann. Kristen Ann. Yeah. Kristen Ann. All right. I don't know. I'm just reading chat as they pop up once in a while. All right, Andy, yeah. Mr. Andy. Uh, do you own a honey dipper? We used to, but now we just use a squeeze bottle. Uh, no honey dipper for Andy, everybody. No honey yeah. dipper. One point if you said no on Andy's, and let's see who's still in first place. Your hair looks great, honey. Yes, Janetta, <laughs> that's true. <laughs> just compliment every time. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> I think we get tricked into trick questions sometimes. The mm -hmm. wives trick us. No matter what we answer, it's bad. <laughs> it's no. going to be wrong. The yes. dress does not make you look bad. <laughs> your hips do, but... Uh, <laughs> yeah, the hips that are in your dress. <laughs> 19 for Darla, 20 for Kristen Ann. Okay, so Kristen, Kristen Ann is, at 20. is 20. What's Andrew saying? Andrew's at 20 as oh, well. Oh, they're they are tied. They are tied. Is it is it between Kristen Ann and Andrew? Is that who who's... Yeah. Uh-huh. No Just other 20s? Mm -hmm. Cal, CG, good try, guys. You guys are doing wonderfully good. <laughs> All right, I'm going to load a wheel up with Andrew and Kristen Ann. Yep. All right. So close, Carol. Wait, what, why don't you do a question there? All right, I'll do yeah. a question. No, well, because I, if we, the thing is, is right now we've already kind of announced who's going to win. Next week I'll do a question. How about that? All right. Next time. Next time I'll do a question. If we do it this time, well, right now we've already said we're going to do a spin-off between Andrew Let's and Kristen. Do a well, let's do the spin-off as your I got her. <laughs> oh, like, so don't count my question as points? Yeah, but they could actually choose yeah. the same answer. Yeah, yeah. So, so let's, just, let's just call it tonight. I'll do one next time, though, guys. If you really want me to answer, I'll do one. Absolutely. Okay. Um, i got to erase all these names off this list. So it wasn't like last week where we had a sexy maid outfit. 
Do you have that? <laughs> Maybe. Let me go grab it. <laughs> that was like, uh, that was like two or three weeks ago. Is it K I R S T E N? Did I get that right? K R I S T E N. K I R K R. It's not not Oops. Kirsten, but oh, Kirsten. I got it wrong. C R I C R I. K R I. K R I. K R I. Oh, I got it really screwed up now. K R I R. All right, Kristen Ann. All right, and Andrew. I spell Andrew wrong. A N D R E W. All right, D R E W. I got Andrew right. All right, we got to we got to copy and paste a few names on here. All right, should be enough. Oop. Oh, we got something's wrong. I knew I should taste <laughs> too many. Kristen, Andrew, Kristen. <laughs> oh, there's a yeah. They both win. Yay! All right, that should be good. Starts with oh, it starts with Kristen Ann, ends with Kristen Ann. That's not right. That should be right. Let's see. Any duplicates? Andrew, Kristen, Andrew, Kristen, Andrew, Kristen, Andrew, Kristen. Andrew, Kristen. All right, perfect. Good All night, right. C. Good night, C. Gene. Thanks for joining tonight, C. Gene. We'll see you next week. Um, we're not going to be here, C. Gene. I'm not going to send you a reminder. So this is your yeah. reminder, C. Gene, on Thursday and Wednesday. <laughs> anyway, good luck, guys. Kristen, Ann, and Andrew. Here we go for a Google Play card. If you win, email me. Um, tell me a little bit about yourself or a lot about yourself, like Dar, like um, Don did, because that was an excellent. Oh, we got two emails tonight so far. People finding the whirlwind on their farm. Um, let me know what you want, a United States or a Canadian card, and whether you like Google or Apple. Um, anyways, good luck, everyone. Here we go. Not everyone. Good luck, Kristen Ann and Andrew. Oh, it's close! It's close! Andrew by a hair! <laughs> good job, Andrew. Yay! Go for it. Good job, Andrew. The Flavins sure are lucky, but I mean, there's a lot of them, so, you know, it, they have good odds. Have to go back to see the challenge. Oh, uh, learn about Don. Oh yeah, yeah. Rewind it and listen about Don. It's a great <laughs> bio. Um, thank you, Don, for sending that. I really. I can show you. Oop, my phone is beeping. Uh, let's see. Let's go back to the farm quickly, and um, we can show we can show uh, Darla what Don looks like because we have that picture of Darla, right? And Rosie's saying good night. Good night, Rosie. <laughs> good night. <laughs> Here, here's my. <laughs> this is Don McPeak in the middle, and oh, Rob is now no longer Rob. We have a new lady. Oh, where would he go? Happy Rob. Uh, I think I filled Rob. Ooh, there's a check mark. Well, let's do that. Yeah. What's my sky race task? I didn't even look. Oh dear. I don't have one. <gasps> oh man, you trashed it. Uh, I trashed it. You, did you see my uh, TikTok this week of my little farmers walking to the uh, 500 miles song, Libby? <laughs> oh no, I, did I? I can't remember. I, I made a TikTok with the with the little visitors walking down the path, and they were singing, and uh, they were singing the proclaimer proclaimer song 500 miles or walk 500 miles. <laughs> oh man, I'm watch it, was, now. it was kind of funny. Anyway, uh, well, guys, um, it is that time to say goodnight. We've been streaming for an hour and we got to wrap it up earlier tonight because I do have to pack still and do some other stuff. Um, the challenge this week, if you didn't know what it was, guys, is the uh, butterfly in the whirlwind. So, search your farm. At least nobody told everybody where the whirlwind was, which is great. Everyone does have the whirlwind and everyone does have butterflies. So, put a butterfly in the whirlwind and you're golden. Anyway... Good night, Mrs. Dark Fairy. Hopefully nobody um, that's usually here isn't here tomorrow, um, missing out. But then they can watch the replay, I guess, tomorrow. And a good night to Patty and Pat. Good night, Pat. Patty and Pat. Mrs. Dark Fairy. I've seen the whirlwind, so that's a start. <laughs> there you go, and Darla. Bella. <laughs> and Bella and Mona. Have and Bella. Good night, along with Kristen Ann. Kristen Cal. Ann. Good night. Good night, Pepper. Cal. Pepper. Oh, did you hear that, Pepper? That guy just gave you a huge, like, clappy clappy. Yeah, he sure did. Hey. Darla <laughs> says good night back to Farman and Seinfeld. Oh, nice. Good Alan luck. says good night. Thank you for the safe tra travels, Don. Appreciate that. Tracy says good night. Thanks for always making it a great evening. Yay. You're welcome, Tracy. Dawn Thanks says so much good night. Coming. Safe travels to you from Thanks, Dawn. Dawn. Yay. Good night from Crystal to her farm friends. Thank you for the fun and laugh. Night, Crystal. Oh, we have a visitor on Libby's, Libby's house. It's okay. 
Andrew says good night and thank you. Welcome, Andrew. Let me know what you'd like. Kathy says night. Good night, Kathy. John says good night. The Royal Renata, Kathy. Kathy. Uh, Carol. Good night, Melinda Carol. Says, good night, all. Safe travels to you, Scott. Perfect. Awesome. Well, thanks, guys. Which one of you guys wants to start us off tonight? Let's go to the large screen. We didn't spend much time on the large screen tonight. Ooh. Libby's got her finger on her nose. What does that mean? You gotta pick it. <laughs> I gotta pick it. <laughs> I'm gonna pick a winner. All right, pick a winner. Go ahead, Libby. <laughs> I'll go. Okay, go, Andy. Uh, good night, everyone. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, uh, we'll oh, week. Libby. Um, we're getting jilt, jilt this week out of uh, another stream. Thanks, God. I'm sorry. Like I said, maybe but, we'll do uh, a live feed. Thanks for hanging out with us, all 23 of you. And, uh, see you next time. Oh, I did it wrong. Oh, you're interrupting Andy's goodbye. And make sure you click the thumbs up if you haven't already. Thank you. All right, Andy, that was great. Yes, like, subscribe, <laughs> share with your friends. Click the alarm bell. Share these videos on your, on your, uh, Facebook. Ooh. You know. Libby's doing sign language right now. Go, Libby. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, have you guys? Wait, before you go, Libby, have you seen the the sign language? Okay, there, there's a video. I don't know if it's on YouTube. I'm pretty sure it's a fake video, but it's really funny. It's um, it's a news reporter report uh, reporting on a crime at a sex store, and there's a interpreter that's doing all the hand things and like the motions. And so they're they're asking her what kind of things were stolen, and they're describing it. And the the interpreter is doing some funny stuff. It's really funny. If you guys haven't watched oh it, oh my gosh! Pretty sure you can just type in like inappropriate interpretation or something. I don't know. I call it. Hey Google. Funny. Hey Google. There you go. All right, Libby, take it away. Uh, sorry for interrupting, Andy. Oh, oh. <laughs> he's gonna do it to me now. <laughs> <laughs> well, good night, everyone. <laughs> Thanks for joining us on Tuesday night. We'll see you again next Wednesday. So, good stuff. Uh, have a good week. Drink your water. Get some exercise. I don't know. <laughs> oh, water, so water. Yep. Oh. <laughs> Andy's almost out. Is it Aquafina? Yes. Aquafina. Mm. So delicious. Aquafina. I love the Aquafina. All right, guys, thank you so much for joining as well. I appreciate each and every one of my <laughs> friends that are in chat and my friends that are on the TV screen, based from, from Libby. <laughs> um, good stuff. <laughs> Have a great week, everybody. We'll be back next week on our normal night and time, and maybe we'll do a surprise stream from actual the, another city. We'll see what happens. Anyways, good night. God bless. Goodbye. Bye.